Hey guys, Jinlux here, back with our blind playthrough of Hollow Knight. So last time we uh, we got back to the Hollow Cliffs, we um, found one of these gravestones and whacked it with a dream nail and uh, got ourselves. Well, we fought Gorb, right? Fought him or his spirit. Got a hundred more essence. And, um... I mean, I... I guess I don't... I didn't really consider going above a hundred. Now we have to go back to the... person with... that we learned a little bit about the dream nail from, I think. But, before we do that, we're gonna explore a little bit more of this. Just because I don't want to have to keep running back and forth if we don't have to. Yeah, do we need to go down there? I don't, I don't remember. I wonder if we could use the dream nail on those things. Oh, hey, that works. Interesting, it doesn't react at all. Normal, normal enemies you can whack with a dream nail and gain soul and hear their thoughts a little bit. But those things you can't. Those things you whack with regular weapons and gain soul. So that's interesting. Um, and then I guess we will fall. We don't... Should we go to Joni's Repose and just see if... Because there was a body there, right? I think we probably should. Sorry, I miss you. Why not pop to our store? Purchase the map we already have. I believe this... You, oh, you guy. And this is where we need to, well, that would have been a shortcut had we been able to open it. You know, the other thing about that, the spore cloud is like, oh, are you leaving again, Jack? Oh, he doesn't like, uh, doesn't like being in the lap while I'm sort of playing with the controller on him. Oh, see that, uh, well, whatever. But yeah, the dude... The Gorb, right? Does a fair amount of damage. Not as much as you'd think, though, possibly. Um... Yeah, Gorb, I wonder if he was avoiding... Oh, you know, if he was avoiding the Spore Cloud, like, deliberately. Yeah, okay, I mean, I guess it's not a magic cure-all thing, right? Um, how do I, oh, I'm, I'm sitting there like jumping and holding down. Oh, or you can just, you don't even have to jump. I'm sitting there trying to hold down. Nope, can't use it on the flowers. Life blooms. I could just listen to him. Do I need to strike him with the nail? Oh man, progress will be saved. I don't want to do that. 
Um, damn it. <clears throat> I'm going to alt F4. I want to know what the dude says. All right, we'll give it a second. I hope it doesn't save. I hate doing that, but it's like... I want to know. Like, that... That makes me feel bad. I, he probably was going to be like, oh, something, something. He probably... I don't even know if he was going to say anything important, but, you know, just the... I didn't expect the attacking with the Dream Nail would kill it. You know what I mean? Like, that... So that makes me feel bad. Also, I'm like, I wanted to know. So, crap, I guess we just wasted five minutes. Oh well, now, now we know though. We've learned something valuable. Which is, don't, uh... Let's just see if we can run back there real fast. Oh, excuse me. Um, which is, you know, like, don't, don't attack dudes. Yeah, okay, Cornifer. Can't do anything with that crap. <laughs> oh my god, again. Nice. Jump straight into the spikes, that's cool. Alright. So, yeah, that's... I'm like, oh, what happens if I attack him? Oh, he's dead. And, oh, by the way, you know, it, it auto-saves. So, I'm like, damn it! Back to, back to the dude then. We'll see what he has to say. He'll be like, don't trust the nail. Or something, right? Like this dude is here for a reason and the spirit seems really happy, you know? Ah, I see you bear my blessing. I can't remember giving it, but my memory has been a little lacking of late. Well, you're dead. Blue child Joni. Isn't it just so peaceful here? Such a perfect place to rest. And I bet... Well, you can leave him there, or... You can kill him for the one essence that he'll give you. Which I'm not gonna do. You can... You bear my blessing, but I don't remember giving it to you. Like, that's... I mean, it was- it was there. I- I took it. Still. Well, it's certainly easier now that that's been smashed. Alright. I'm glad we actually went back that way. You know? Now that we get to have seen what the deal was. Let's go down. 
And I remember, I remember falling like the whole way. Right. So I'm looking for partially the tree. What about you? Higher beings, blasted planes. There's no world beyond. Pay the toll, relinquish the precious mind. Nope, doesn't work. Okay. Dream nail does not work on those stones. Neither on that. Uh, I guess it only works on graves, right? And it, it hurts spirits. See, this worries me. This worries me too. Like, inspect. Corpse of a large bug. Do I attack it? All right. Um. What now? Uh oh. Do I want to attack this thing? This thing is the symbol of the root, right? The whispering root or whatever. Or maybe I, uh... We have, like, red dream stuff. Corpse of a large bug. Okay. What's the point of doing that? That definitely did something. There was some reason to do it. Um... Okay, well, I mean, I guess I'll take this off. That's... I mean, I... You know, I did something there. It's probably not something we could do yet. What was this way? Down. Or whatever, you know, that was... Here we go. Alright, well, I mean, we're here, so we're gonna... Ah, crap. like half paying attention I'm just looking at the red the red things you know kind of surprised there was this many not that I mind and I bet like it's not I feel like with these Trees, it's not about the essence crap. Oh, dicks. Oh, dicks. And then you keep moving back and forth to the, the different... The different stuff, you know? And it definitely looks different now, right? I wonder if that shows you how many there are left. Probably not. But, uh, I mean, I suspect it's not about the getting the essence, although I'm sure that has its own function. Oh, crap. That <laughs> um, it's, it's about the tree. You know, there's essence and whatever that does for us, but also the tree itself. 
activating that is presumably important for uh, a reason that we don't yet know. Man, there's a lot of these little things. I see. Man, there's there are a lot of these things. Wow. That's still not all of them, huh? My gosh. Oh, well, all right. There is... Still... No. How many are left? Can't be that many. It was Joni, right? That was the ghost's name. It's odd. I mean, I feel like... I have no idea. I was gonna say, maybe there's like some secret... Secret thing. Oh, hello. King's Idol. That's gotta be another one of those treasures, right? Yeah. Yeah. A white idol depicting the king of Hallowness. The elusive king was worshipped through these idols. Relic from Hallowness past. This item now holds little value except for those dedicated to the kingdom's history. What happens if I keep going this way? Oh, it's... Slower and slower. I think that's it. I think it won't let me go. I was wondering, like, if you do make it to the edge and leave what happens does it instant game over like permanently or you know what i mean or it gives you a different ending or or what all right well i don't want to go this way just yet let's go there's got to be one more maybe even a couple more of these things somewhere that red thing was because I was just like you know we're hitting it and the sparks seem to be coming out in greater numbers or a greater amount or whatever I'm like is it even doing anything am I supposed to be doing this and then it's like okay it's on fire now now what We're gonna go... Go that way, go back. We'll see how many are... How many are left in this tree? Come at me, bro! What was that? I got essence from it? Just randomly? So is Essence kind of like humanity? Still two. So they're probably... Hmm. Ouch. Well, you know. So I bet what this is, is this thing. 
it's just like, oh, here, somewhere, somewhere in here is that thing, right? It's not the actual... The Whispering Root is probably this, not the tree thing that I activated. So, all right, now let's figure out how to get back here. I don't think we could take this elevator or whatever a sideways elevator is. Train, <laughs> you know? Um, we could go, go down towards Green Path again. We have to go up, though. We have to go down to the basically the King's Station, then go up into the resting grounds. I mean, unless we want to go through Crystal Peak again, but not not really, no. Uh, so, actually, maybe it'd be faster just to go down here. Mm, but I don't think it was that one. It was all the way at the bottom. Yep, gotta say this is definitely a proper Metroidvania game. I didn't believe it. I was like, I was like, oh, this is more like a you know side-scrolling Dark Souls. What was down there again? Oh, that's right, 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 right. Yes, indeed. Spikes. Spikes are bad. At least when you touch them, they're bad. And where are we going? Um, let's go down. We'll see if we can get that um, lifeblood thing. Alright, come here, little guy. Ah! Uh, away, away. It's probably what they're... Oh, wow, that guy still takes two, two hits. Wait, does it use the spores when I'm shooting as well? Ah, uh, not... Oh, well, good, good, good show. No, it doesn't. Kill for light, for un. Interesting. Okay, well. For light, for un. I wonder if I should go back to the, uh... So the, the little bugs that were wandering around were saying light was dangerous, but dark was safe. So I wonder if Hallow Nest is dark. But I get the impression that Un was here before. Oh, wait, wait, let's go up. Maybe it is like, you know, like the, uh, oh, wait, wait, we gotta go up. Yeah. Hey, buddy. Oh, I should have. No, I want to see if we can do anything new with this statue up here. Greater mind once dreamed of leaf and cast these caverns, so in every bush and every vine the mind of Un re reveals itself to us. Okay. Well, let's go revisit the Lake of Un real fast. We'll see if there's anything... way. I think. Alright. Yep. Gotta be careful. Don't want to fall into the drink. Lake of Un. Hmm. All right.
I really thought these, uh, like they had a little, like, three pollen things right above here. I was like, is that a spider? Just my brain. Mmm. <sighs> it's crazy, too, because I'm drinking, uh, coffee. Line. I mean, these things don't. Well, I'm sure they do have thoughts. Anyway. Alright, back to King's Station. And then we'll try and go. King's Station. So I want to know what that person, they're like, oh, I'll teach you how to use the dream nail if you bring us a hundred essence. It's like, all right. I, to be fair, I assumed it was all about the trees. I didn't realize, hang on, is there something up here? I feel like there is something, but I can't get up there yet. Alright, where where to? Up. Right, through the posh the posh area. But I can move. Oh. Yeah, it takes a minute to charge up. Kind of like the nail, actually. Oh, wow, you're... down there? Do I need to kill any more of those dudes, like the big dudes? Uh, which one? Not you. Oh, not the Mantis Lords. Yeah, Heavy Sentry. Yeah, basically just kill kill everything. Um, didn't, didn't want to go that way, but alright. Hey, buddy. That works, though. Oh, they're coming in from behind. Man, you're... I mean, good. Really good, actually. It's not. <laughs> it's not. Oh no! It's not what I want, but. Oh no! Oh, that was farther than I figured. Alright. I mentioned Positron in the last video, right? Or was it the one before that? Either way, yeah, check him out. I mean, he's. Ooh, have we been up? No, we're going for the elevator. We'll ignore that for now. Um, good job, dude. It's gotta be like half hits. Is this the elevator? Oh man, yeah, we have to go all the way up again. 
That's fine. I mean, we're going to the resting grounds. It'll be all right. Oh, and... I noticed the music kicked in there, too. Nice. We got someone. Probably the winged dudes. Man, you're... Okay, we're gonna... Oh, dicks! Maybe that's where the balder shell comes in, or maybe where I just suck less. <laughs> you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Oh, I did go up. So I haven't been there before. I thought I was... I thought I had already gone left, but I had not. Well... Good to know. Um, fair enough. That explains why I didn't quite remember that area. We just gotta be careful. I wonder, I mean, how I'm doing compared to the average person. Because I feel like... Wow, that's... You're good, dude. I mean, I, I feel like I'm taking more hits, definitely, but... Um, you know, I wonder if the average person is just... Oh, that was good. He really jumped. And I... Took some hits there, too. Do I go up again? No, I don't think so. I think up gives us... I wish we could knock them back. This is the way I'm supposed to go. But, I mean, my shade is, you know. Yep, and when you get hit, you stop charging. So there's... Ah, oh, man. That's not what I want to do either. <laughs> uh. Are you done flailing your noodle arms at the air? <laughs> Alright. Let's go up. Uh, see if I can lure my shade out first. Otherwise it's... Yeah, see the music... No, I, well, I hear the shade first off. Come here. Come here, guy. Where is my shade? Got him, I think. There we go. Much, much better. All right, let's charge up and then we'll charge in. Oh, man. I got essence. All right, well. Okay, I'm... How about no? How about no? Oh, come on, dude. Watch out. Watch out. No, no, no. Oh, my God. What happened there? I think I tried to shoot, but they were just moving too fast. I need to... <sighs> All right. Um... Part of the issue is... I mean, it could just be my controller, but I think that I have, like, 
there's cooldowns and stuff, right? There's, uh... Maybe that's the wrong word for it, but you can't, you can't, you don't attack as fast as you push the button. Um, also you're... When you hit an enemy, it sort of... It sort of locks you in place for a second. I don't know, I just need to be able to heal. Oh, let's... Because those dudes, they keep coming. They keep coming. Like, so they don't really give you a chance to heal. Um... Gotta be careful of my shell. Oh my god. That's hard. There better be something good after that, but I suspect there's not. And you jumped over... <laughs> like, oh, there was a, one of the dudes gave me something. Oh, Gorb, yeah. Lingering dream of a fallen warrior, a mysterious life form that claimed to contain all of the world's knowledge inside of its distended brain. I am Gorb. Gorb. Gorb quotes himself. That makes sense. Um, where is... Was it one of these? No, it was... This one, I think. Winged Sentry. Flying Sentry of Hallow Nest. Dances through the air just out of reach until it spots an opening, then swoops in for a decisive strike. If you're confident, wait for it to come to you, then counterattack. I don't know how confident I am, to be honest. Um, right. That works. I would almost wager that the the cyclone attack does more damage. Probably only hits a couple times though. All right, where is my shade? Okay, I mean, I see it. Or I saw the part of it. All right. Which one was that? Husk. Husk Dandy, former member of Hallowness High Society, limited offensive ability. <coughs> <coughs> Whoa. It seems the weakest, greediest members of Hallowness were also the ones who exerted the most influence. Truly a kingdom that was always destined for ruin. Uh, like our society, I would say. Alright, my little shade, I need you to come to me. Alright, well. Alright, let's go down here. We will... Whack some dudes, maybe, or maybe we won't. I guess we won't. Alright, let's go... God. That's two hits. Oh my god. Oh no, what am I doing? Why are there... Oh my god, they keep coming. See, there's two, 
two musical things now. They're supposed to be this badass music, but it's also the background. They kind of messed it up because I died a few times. Oh, and these guys weren't even part of it. It was just like the... Oh, neat. Mask shard. Right on. Or... Soul shard? Yeah, one of those. I'll take it, though. You know? That was... Worth it. My poor little shell. I'm sitting there trying to heal, and then I'm like, No, I need to be, like, dodging and stuff. What am I doing? Alright, well... Still, it'll work until... Alright, so we're here... We need to go... Yeah, there's... I don't even know where the save point is. If there is one. I mean, there's gotta be one somewhere. Let's go... Let's go up there. We'll, we'll try going to the left first, all the way, see if there's a save point maybe right there. I mean, there, there has to be one. Oh, right. Hey, buddy. Oh, wow, you do a backswing, too. Did I, uh... My god. Those were the same dudes, right? The husk sentries? Oh god, and I gotta deal with you. Outsider, that's me. Oh wait, these are not the dudes that attack up. can go up, but I want to go this way, see what... It's like a beach. It's very odd. Hopefully... Blue Lake. So there's the Lake of Un, and then there's the Blue Lake. Will I take damage in here? No. Please don't be a fish. Like, I just worry about something coming up from the depths to eat me. You know? Like that? Yeah. Like I hear a freaking heartbeat? You mean like that? Yes, exactly. I'm just gonna keep going. It definitely sounds like there's something... I mean, it could be up, but it could be below us as well. NPC? Tiso. Have we met this dude before? I don't think so. Gar, what a calm place. It's action I want. Vicious and deadly battle. This serenity is a bore. Maybe we met this dude near the arena or something. So peaceful, so dull. I imagine you don't want to use your dream nail on random people. That seems like, like it's rude. Sana. Yep. Okay, well that goes somewhere. Let's see if this is a save point. Wait. Well, I, I mean, I... I mean, technically, yes, but I don't want to just fall down. Interesting. Um, because I can't get up yet. But also, at the same time, I don't... Where's the heartbeat? I, I hope it's one of those lifeblood hearts, not like a giant fish monster beneath the surface coming to eat me, you know? That was the freakiest thing, playing Subnautica. You know, you're, you're swimming, 
and you kind of, you know, I don't like being on the surface because you can never see what's below you. So it's like just underneath the surface. But then you start going towards, you know, like wherever, and you just see the ground like slowly fall away until you can't see it anymore. And you're just like, oh my God. That's like, oh, all right. It's like the most terrifying thing. A lever. All right. Not that I'm objecting, but... Resting grounds. Well, that's something right there. Is that the grave of a... Oh. Why did that just appear on my map? Because I hadn't been in the same room as it before? But why... Hmm. Was I not able to go down this way before? Like, this room didn't connect to the one I'm... Only I went over there and that connected. I don't know. Let's, uh... We still have time. This is where I awakened? Or I got here first and then I went into the dream and that's... And then I ended up above, right? To protect the vessel, the dreamers lay sleeping. Monomon, the teacher, in her archive, surrounded by fog and mist. Luria, the watcher, in a spire, looking over the city. Hera, the beast, in her den, amidst the deep darkness beyond the kingdom. Right, so that's got to be deep nest. I, maybe, in the spire, looking over the city, which is the city of tears. Archive, surrounded by fog and mist. Through their devotion, Hallowness lasts eternal. The vessel, like, what, what vessel? Uh, where's my map? Oh, it is in Deep Nest. Okay. Deep Nest is just freaking huge. If you look at it, because that means it goes all the way... Well, yeah. Alright, well, let's... Back to... Back to this thing, right? Was, uh... Okay, yeah. Well, hello. Strange door. I don't know if I noticed this before, but this is a moth, which was, like, the thing that we saw at the end of the vision. Ah, uh, Wielder, you've returned. Let me have a look at the dream now. Hmm. Already you've collected a hundred essence. Quick work. Things come naturally to you, don't they? No wonder the dreamers tried to bury you in that old dream. Perhaps you frightened them, or perhaps, being prisoners themselves, they desired your company. In any case, you still have a long way to go. Take this old trinket as encouragement from me, and return when you have collected two hundred essence. I see. Hallow Ness Seal. I thought you were going to teach me more. Oh, hang on. Right. I still don't know what... I haven't found someone we're supposed to... Who does anything with these, but we'll figure it out. Hmm. Well, um... There's got to be a save point around here somewhere. Did I... Did I miss this? Stag line right here? Oh my gosh. Oh, that's why. I probably could have bought this as soon as I left the, um... The Sears place, right? Yep, purchase a map. That makes sense. Rest and update the map. Open the gate, and there you go. Stag line 
activated. Cool. Uh, well, do I want to go anywhere? No. Sorry to summon you and run away, dude, but uh, we have like 10 minutes left. Let me go down and we'll try going to the right, whatever is out there. Also, I'm pretty close on to the 200. this. Well, I guess this is not anything I can use the dream nail on. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I have been down this way. Sleep. Light. Sleep. Oh. Hey, buddy. Alive. More light. Alive. More light. Well, all right. Oh, that's right. I forgot about those guys. Ouch. Man, I take... Well, I mean, I... I'm a little bit kamikaze, to be honest. What was this way? Just this treasure? Yeah, I'm just like, I'm just like, I'm gonna stand here and take your hits and you're just gonna... Have we... What was the deal with this? Let me rest. Did we whack this before? Let me rest. Maybe so. Hmm. I don't know. We'll uh, we'll ignore it for now. Blue Lake, right? I mean, there's something up there though. We have a few minutes left. Let's see if we can go back to that uh, that thing. Where is th Ouch. How many more of those need to need to die near me? All right, we're back here, so let's go left and up and Look at the statue, I suppose. Oh man, you again, right? Oh, you do attack up. Well, ow! Um, okay, well. I mean, that works. Where are we going up? Jesus Christ. Okay, do I wanna... 
Don't want to do this now. Do you know what I mean? What if that's like a boss or something? <clears throat> oh. <clears throat> Stop there. Those who try to leave this kingdom are cursed. Better to rest here until time itself sleeps. Hope and freedom. I thought that strength alone could grant me these things. In my dreams, I would cut that plague with my nails, and then I turned my weapons upon the king. In my dreams, I would cut the plague with his nails. Well, the sword. And then I turned my weapons upon the king. When I awoke in this sacred place, I began to understand. Those who hope are already doomed. Do you still hope, Wanderer? Will you flee, or will you raise your weapon and doom us both? <clears throat> Challenge the warrior dream. Not right now. Um, let's go save first. And then we'll challenge it next time. Do I want to... Hmm. How's my loadout? Is it good? I don't know. It's probably all right. Anyway, we'll stop here for now. That's it for today. Uh, that's it for today, guys. Thank you guys so much for your time and attention. Really do appreciate it. Really hope you guys are enjoying these episodes. Uh, what is your guys' unique positive moment? for today uh for me um i'm gonna say the the positron the am2r playthrough that i mentioned um i'm enjoying it i'd recommend it to anyone that has played am2r and likes it is you know um he's he's pretty chill and um genuine i mean you can't see his face that is a little bit more like he does voice only um, and I do actually appreciate the face cam because you you see more emotion that way, uh, but but it's you know it, it feels genuine. He does do the the cuts. He doesn't do it uncut uh, like I do. But that's um I mean that's how everyone does it. Everyone cuts their their stuff. So so whatever. Um, but that's uh, you know like I said, recommend him. Uh, but that's my unique puzzle moment. Hopefully your guys are just as good, if not better. Hopefully better, of course. And I hope to see you guys next time. Till then, guys, take care.